How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Here in today's video, I'll go ahead and walk you through and how you can connect your wireless earbud with your Nothing Phone 1. So if you have any earbuds from Nothing, Samsung, or Beat Studio, or from Google, or even from an Apple AirPod, don't worry. Let me go ahead and show you how you can connect them at the very same time. If you have any problem in terms of connecting those devices with a Nothing Phone 1, we will give you the solution as well. So let's get started with the Nothing Air 1 first. Now, if you want to connect it first, make sure your Nothing Air 1 has enough charge and it is ready to pair. After that, just go ahead and open this up. And now, make sure to just take a look at a new screen. Now, sometime, well, you're going to get a quick prompt. With that, you actually can tap on connect and your device is going to get connected. For some reason, if you don't get this prompt, you can simply press and hold this button for about 3 seconds. And after that, you're going to get this prompt right on your screen. Once you get this prompt, just go ahead and tap on connect there. Tap on setup and your device is going to be set up just in a moment. Well, now as you guys can see, it is already connected with this device here. That means that we have successfully connected our Nothing Air 1 with our Nothing Phone. Now, if I want to listen to anything here, I'll be able to do it and I'll be able to listen to anything from anywhere I want. So this is how you guys can connect your Nothing Air 1 with your Nothing Phone. Now let's go ahead and talk about how you guys connect your Samsung Buds 2 with your Nothing Phone 1. Now if you want to just connect it, be sure also that it has a proper charge and it is on the pairing mode. And after that, you can just easily connect it on your device. So all you want to do on your Nothing Phone, you want to just open up your settings on your device there. And now you want to just tap on that connected device here. Now tap on pair a new device. Now you can wait un unless you see your device is coming up. Now here's the problem. Some people say they can't get to see their device a well ability right here. If it happens with you, then all you need to do, you want to just press and hold that both AirPod just with your two finger unless you see the color changes in the middle. If you do that, that means it will set your device into the pairing mood and after that, you'll be able to get your device right here. Now, once you get your device here, just go ahead and tap on connect here and now it's going to give you a prompt, tap on allow access, tap on pair and your device is going to be connected right away. Now it's just active, that means I can listen to music or anything I want directly from my phone and I'll be able to hear it from my Samsung device. Now let's go ahead and bring up the Bit Studio and see how you can connect it and if you have any problem how you can solve it as well. First also you gotta have to follow the same rules. You need to make sure that your device is properly charged and it is on the pairing mode in order to connect it with your device. Now once you just open up the case, most likely you're gonna get a prompt just like that on your phone. Now you gotta just tap on connect. If you don't get this prompt here, don't worry, you can lock this phone or unlock it or you can just press and hold this button here unless you get this prompt comes on your device. So just go ahead and tap on connect here, tap on setup here and your device is gonna be set up and ready. Okay, so it's going to open up your application. Well, if you haven't installed this application, you got to install this application from your Google Play Store. After that, just tap on Get Started. Tap on Don't Send if you don't send the information there. Tap on Next. Now tap Allow there. And now it's going to say this. Okay, just tap Got It here. Now your device is successfully connected with that phone. Now if you play anything from here, your device is going to start giving you the sounds. Alright guys, now let's go ahead and talk about how you guys can literally get your Google Pixel Buds connected with your Nothing Phone 1. Now to connect it, make sure it has enough charge and your case is open. Most likely you're going to get a prompt. If you get it, you can continue with that. Some people say they don't get this prompt. If you don't get it, you can press and hold this button on the back of this device and you can wait unless you get that prompt on your device. But for some reason, if you don't get this prompt on your Nothing Phone 1, then you can do one little work so you can simply open up your settings on our device there and then you can tap on connected device and now you got to just tap on pair and new device now here you got to just choose your pixel buds a series here just go ahead and tap on there and now your device is going to get this prompt tap allow tap pair and your device is going to be connected just like that so that means now your device is connected and you can listen to any music that you want from your phone to your google pixel buds all right, guys, now let's go ahead and learn how you can connect your Apple AirPod with your Nothing Phone 1. So here I got an AirPod third generation here. I got a Nothing Phone. Let's go ahead and connect it together. Now, first, make sure it has enough charge and it is on the pairing mode in order for you to connect it with your Nothing Phone on. So first, just go ahead and open up your settings on your device there. Tap on Connected Device. And here you got to tap on Pair a New Device. And tap on there. 
And after that, what's going to happen there, you're going to be able to see these devices kind of coming up right here. But for some reason, if you see, well, it's not coming up here, don't worry, just turn it back on and now press and hold this button for about a few seconds unless you see the color changes. In the meanwhile, they're going to get your devices coming up right on your device. And it says uh, the AirPod, I'll tap on there, that's my AirPod. I'll tap on allow access to my contacts and all call history. I'll tap on pair. And now this device is going to be connected on my phone here. So as you guys can see, now this device is connected and it's just active. That means if I play any music here, I'll be able to listen it directly from my Apple AirPod. So this is how you guys can connect all the AirPod from any brand with the Nothing Phone 1. Hope you find this video useful. If you think so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching this video and I'll talk to you later.